And, you know, I was talking to a guy the other day, and he asked me, what are you going to do about cheap car insurance in our great country? And I asked him, I said, what do you mean? What's the problem? And he told me, excuse me, sir, have you seen the cost of car insurance in Britain? I mean, have you seen how much they pay? And I told him, no, I hadn't looked. And then he told me I should. So I looked up at the cost of car insurance in Great Britain. And, you know, i got to tell you, the guy was right. I'm serious. Car insurance in Britain is much, much more expensive than anything we have over here. And you know what? That is just not acceptable. Why? Why do you ask that? Well, let me tell you why. Decent American people are driving around worried that their car insurance isn't up to the job. You know why? Because they think it's too cheap. And cheap means no good. Everyone knows that. So they're worried. Decent American people are worried. They get in their cars... And they're worried. And worried, you know what that means. Worried means accidents. And you know what accidents mean. Accidents mean car insurance goes up. And when it goes up, what happens? You have to pay more for it. And you know what happens when people have to pay more? They get poorer. And that's what happens. And when the people get poorer, the country gets poorer. America gets poorer. And that is unacceptable. So it is unacceptable that people get in their cars feeling poorer and worried because they think they have to pay too little for their car insurance because people in Britain are paying more. And then they panic. They think, oh, my God, what's going to happen if I run down an old lady or a kid or someone who's in this country illegally? Maybe they wouldn't be such a bad thing. And they think, will my car insurance cover me? And they tell themselves, no, it won't because it's too cheap. So they panic more and they have more accidents. Listen, the people in Britain can't afford to get car insurance. Most of them can't even afford to drive Lamborghinis or Bentleys like me, because let's be honest, I mean, I'm very rich. So that means fewer cars on the road, and that means less fuel sold, and fewer cars sold, and that's not good for American business. So you know what we're going to do, right? I am going to personally force down the cost of British car insurance. Watch me. I'm going to do it. And we're going to force the British... To get more people driving, and we're going to stop the British from using car insurance as a secret weapon against our great nation, or I am going to build a wall across the Atlantic Ocean, and I promise you this, they're going to pay for it.